Hi guys, we are here with Billboard Pride and I am here with Shia Diamond. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Thanks for asking, Patrick. <laughs> of course. Um, and Shia is in our first ever Pride issue, the magazine. Um, you just did some photo shooting. Hold on, wait a minute. You starting too fast. I'm the first at something. Yeah. <laughs> You have an EP coming out at the end of this month, and it is called Seen It All. It's not only a song, it's, it's more um, of, of my testament, of, of like what I thought. I thought, literally thought I'd seen it all. I thought that life had dealt me my cards, and that's all it would, would be. Incarceration, I knew what that looked like, you know, foster home. I've been a, a product of every system already, so I just thought that's what my life would be. I thought I would probably even die in prison. But seeing it all, you know, I made it out of there. Mm -hmm. And I'm a sign artist. I'm with mm -hmm. Billboard having breakfast. You know, <laughs> like, I thought I'd seen it all. You were actually at a protest, the, the uh, Trans Lives Matter event, when you were, when you sang I Am Her, and that's how Justin Tranner discovered you. Yes. Right? Tell me about yes. that. Well, um, for me, um, I had just gotten over a divorce, and um, so, Basically, you know how relationships go. They break you before they, before they just go. They don't just go, they're gonna break you first. <laughs> Let me make sure you're no good for nobody else first. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so I didn't want to eat. Uh, I was falling to depression. And so somebody, in, um, it was a trans woman uh, from community. She was like, girl, you gotta come out. So um, the first thing she took me to was this um, amazing place um, called um, Ar the Audrey Lord Project. Okay. And, um, and so, and she asked me to sing, and from there it was like history. I mean, they never stopped. You know, they they literally never stopped asking me the same af afterwards. It's like, you know what? We can need you over here for this protest. Come <laughs> over here. We got this protest. Come and sing this. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, I, you know, the song that I had wrote while incarcerated, "I Am Her," yeah. just became this anthem for every single movement, mm -hmm. and the, from the women's movement to the trans movement to even the 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 the, the gay movement as well. Mm -hmm. Like, you know. Um, so they was like, okay, we all can uh, resonate, we all can relate to I Am Her. For sure. And so um, I sang I Am Her a cappella for so long. I know people just got tired of hearing that song. <laughs> and Justin came and saved the day. Okay. And he literally came and saved the day. And um, I was able to really record it yeah, um, yeah. in its um, authentic authenticity. Mm -hmm. And um, so for me, um, Justin brought some magic to that song. So your next single, um, American Pie, is the music video is coming out at the end of the, the month. Um, did you write that while you were incarcerated as well? I did not. You did not, okay. Um, uh, I wrote American Pie here in New York City. All right. We all have this American dream, like mm -hmm. this quote unquote American dream and what that would look like. So to each person, it looks different. So what I said is instead of it being just completely an, an oxymoron mm -hmm. and it being just this plant on pie, that it's life. Yeah. You know, so I just want a piece of the American dream. Yeah. And so that's what the, the, the pie uh, symbolizes. And so um, how would it taste if you had a slice of this pie that mm -hmm. everybody else has access to? Mm -hmm. How would it taste? How well, would it smell? And my favorite lyric from that song is, who's the same I want is not a need. Exactly. It's such a good. Yeah, for, for that, um, a lot of people like to um, say that, you know, you don't need this or, or, or possibly you can do without that. So a lot of people mm -hmm. tell you what you need in life. Mm -hmm. And, um, but, you know, and a lot of people will tell you, okay, just because you jumped over that, over that broom don't mean that there was a, a struggle to you. Mm -hmm. So struggle looks different to different people. And yeah. so for me, I wanted to make sure I relayed that too, all that in, in, in the song. Everybody doesn't have this thing that is sometimes given to some people without having to earn it. And so, um, so for me, just having a, a piece of that American Pie meant that, that it was just a slice of, 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 of life, that beautiful uh, slice of, of, of life. And um, who's gonna say that me wanting that is not a need, right. you know what I mean? <laughs> um, well, that's all the time I have today, but um, thank you so much for 
being in our first ever Pride issue. I'm so excited. Um, and I know you're like kind of excited about it. I am uh, so excited. <laughs> Thank you for watching Billboard Pride.